Hello guys, so today we've got another parcel from eBay and here should be um, an ash vacuum now I ordered this not to clean like ash out of my barbecue but to actually clean vacuums out because they have very strong well I think they have very strong blowers on them so it should be good for that to so blow the motes out of the machines so open this up. I don't know if it's in an internal box or not, or this is the top or the bottom. So here we are, oh, yeah, this is the top. So here we have a cable. Very, very short. Uh, it's got a blow on it, which is good. Um, so here it is. It's just a tin can with a vacuum motor attached to it basically. So, you know, it's quite small, so we can, that stick and come off, go in there, that is that, right, so it's got a collapsible handle, swing it around, so here's the motor filter, just a nice painted thing, that's just come off, like that, there we go, tiny little motor, Nice big filter. Um, I suppose it could be um, converted into wet and dry. <laughs> I'll just I'll tell you what you could do. You could take that off, put a, like a ball that would fit over that into the cage, and it could be used as a wet vacuum, I suppose, if you could be bothered to faff around with changing over the motors. And all that's turd. Right, so there's the the lid. Um, we have the manual which we don't really need. The hose which is quite flexible. Right, so what end? Right, so this end goes into the vacuum itself. Then we have um, the metal part which just goes in there. Which is in there. Uh, I want to see if a Henry crevice tool will fit on here. I don't have to use it with the dead attachment it comes with. Uh, it's a bit too small. But I uh, have the old style one, which is too big. So I want to see. We'll see where one fit. No. Right, so we can't adapt to something, I suppose. But that tool is rubbish, really. So this end actually, well, yeah, it comes off. It's a metal hose in there. I could even just take that off, to be fair. That's a bit Henry adapter. Yeah, Henry's adap Henry adapter will fit in there. Which is good. Find another Henry adapter. I think we might have one here. I'm not too sure. But, um... We just, there we go. So we've got a Henry adapter. We can put that on there. There you go. We can have a longer hose. Or oh, what we could do is we could actually just put a normal Henry hose on there if it would fit and use that. But we'll just wait and see. So we'll just screw all this back on. This just feels very cheap to be fair. But it was only 27 quid, so I can't complain. Can we? Right, so you know, this fits. That all just fits in there. Don't know what the point of that is. Yeah, it's just an end. So you can see. Right, so it's just got all this rubbish back in. Ah, ha, ha. Big dent inside of the motor. Could probably push that out. But, you know, it's only going to get used to the rubbish. So, it's not the point. It seals then, you know. I won't do anything about it. Yeah, it just feels a bit turd, to be fair. The cable, what the hell... This is rubbish cable. Oh no. Well, um, 
Right, let's just have a look at the plug on this. Yeah. This has been smashed around properly, this has. This is bad. I mean, what the hell? So it's, yeah. Let's just say this has been properly mashed by Hermes. But we can fix it, I suppose. Let's just take the lid off. To be fair, we might even chuck a longer cable on that in the future. But I suppose the head flow would even fit in there, to be fair. I might even use it with a bag. Right, so let me just try and straighten this prong up. Boy. Bending it back. Mm, I don't know if that's going to hold up. If it doesn't hold up, I'll just put a new plug on it. And see if the back will straighten up. It's probably going to get dented up anyway, so. No biggie. Right, um, all you've got to do really is just bend it back out. Not even turned it on yet, so you know, it's no good. We can send it back, can't we? Let's put it right over here because we can't even pull the buffer in. Right. <laughs> Let's just say the blower is very powerful on it. So, you know, that's good. Well, that's all right. 27 quid. You know, I might even just take it apart and modify it now. Um, so let me just go and get some bits and we'll modify this so I'll be back in a minute right so here we go it's all um, modified so it's got a longer bit of pipe on it I've just taped another bit of pipe to the original bit uh, it's got a crevice tool, hoover crevice tool and I've put a long orange cable on it off of the vax I think it was so you know it's going to be much better. This was the original bit of cable, probably about a metre long. Piece of rubbish. Got the suppressor, which oh, I just chucked it off because you know, don't know why, but cause it probably won't blow. And you've got this rubbish, which is rubbish. So, anyway, let's just clean all this rubbish up. <laughs> Let's just test out the blower, see if that's improved. Right, so it makes a funny noise. Probably at the front here. It's making a funny noise, but uh, it doesn't really matter. As long as it blows, that's all I care about. So, yeah, it's a bit sketchy, but it's okay for what it is. So there you go, modified. So I hope you enjoyed the video.
please like subscribe if you've enjoyed and excuse the phone and bye for now